Hey Aqua, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well. So let's see what's going on with my beautiful and my handsome Aquarius. Okay, thank you guys for your love, your support, your donations, and your super thanks. I'm sending all that love right back to you all tenfold, okay? So let's see what's going on here for my Aquas. Okay. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses. Please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Aqua and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones return it back to the sender. Block any interferences that can be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Aquas. And protect me as I channel the messages for Aquarius. What's going on for my aquas? So we got love affair, intense and unlikely, out of the blue. Unsent messages, unscribbling without, I mean, scribbling without sending. a lot so we have provocateur not afraid to challenge status quo ruffles a few feathers and challenger tampering sabotaging bully deceitful persuading others negatively and flames wild things short-lived karmic connections mm. close encounter divinely protected so close potentially harmful heightened sense of vulnerability surreptitious a naughty secret a secret affair what the fuck with all this sexual energy Somebody here could be starting rumors about you or talking shit about you because they miss you. But I don't feel like they're letting these hoes know that. <laughs> okay, like that's not what these hoes are thinking with their stupid ass. Or they could be getting these people to do things to you. Or whatever this is, man. So for some of you, somebody is trying to... You could be dealing with another Aquarius... Somebody is trying to figure out if they should send you a message or not. And I feel like they know that they shouldn't. <laughs> Let's start there. I feel like they know that they shouldn't send you shit. Period. Somebody is doing too much. Let's see. The chariot in reverse so cancer so coercion somebody's trying to coerce somebody into doing something or something is just like out of damn control someone here doesn't have a sense of direction let's see what's the love affair here knight of swords what's love affair with the knight of swords the tower and the seven of pentacles in reverse. Why the hell he up there making all that damn noise? Taurus, Saturn, here we got Aries, Scorpio, Gemini. So yeah, there's a tower moment here. I feel like you are remaining focused. You're not going to keep, you're not going to be indulging in some sort of love affair mess. There could be a fast change or a sudden shift here, but I feel like this is you remaining focused. Or this could be somebody coming to rescue you from a tower, from a potential tower. This Knight of Swords could be someone that is seizing an opportunity with you. Or um, they're coming in to stop something from happening or occurring. Whatever this may be. Cause that's somebody that is like um what's the word i'm looking for they're a leader this is somebody this is like somebody coming to your rescue really so yeah there's a sudden shift or a sudden change of plans with that seven of pentacles in reverse you're all of a sudden not investing into something here you're you could be getting some sort of downloads or something here about a love affair that you maybe didn't know that you were in <laughs> okay like 
The tower is a sudden realization or whatever. Yeah, what's the matter of swords? You're having a realization that something is not real or it's a facade or it's not where you need to be at. Yeah, the ace of wands in the reverse. Yeah, so that's like a delay or setback here. What's the ace, what's the matter of with the ace of wands reverse and the five of wands? Yeah, you're no longer interested in competing or fighting with any damn body. Somebody, somebody, this is like sad or disappointing news too, bad news. But this is like a being disinterested or a blockage when it comes down to somebody's creative endeavors or just their, somebody's energy is blocked. Or somebody's being, being hit with a lot of delays and setbacks. Because they ain't your energy tampering with some shit that ain't got no business. Hmm. What's the tower? Yeah, okay, wow, the chariot came up upright. Good. What's the tower with the chariot? So yeah, I feel like you're being tri you're triumphant or you're victorious in something. You're really, really um staying focused is a big thing here. This is you being determined to do something and you're getting right through it here. And so with the, with this being like this, I feel like um Wow. With it with the tower and the chariot being like this, or with the chariot being like this, it's causing a tower for some damn body. For some of you, it could be this fake ass karmic couple. The Emperor reverse, Queen of Cups reverse, the Sun reverse, and the Empress in the reverse. Mm. So you've pushed through something and this is you being triumphant and successful. So the divine is intervening and whatever the fuck this was. What's the tower with these chariots? <laughs> yeah, the six of swords. Yeah, your guides are moving you forward. Your guides are moving you away from something and it's causing a tower somewhere. I mean, it could be a tower for you, but I feel like it's more so of a good tower. Or, I mean, I feel like it's unexpected, but I feel like you know why now. Or you're going to know why a spirit has moved you away from something. Yeah, like... Mm. so this is you moving into peaceful and calmer waters or you're just moving forward in your journey this is things you know you're smooth sailing from here so i feel like uh you you won something you got a victory and somebody else is ass you're ready to get fucked up yeah the magician reverse with the page of swords what the fuck is the seven of pentacles reverse you bitches and all this weak ass magic that's what y'all get so yeah somebody made a bad investment nine of wands in reverse What's Seven of Pentacles reverse, Nine of Wands reverse? <clears throat> the Knight of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, somebody's unable to finish what they started. Or you could be giving up on a situation with somebody here that keeps on being in and out or being inconsistent. They're unreliable. You can't depend on them for shit. They're weak or they could be a deadbeat or something like that. Very superficial, materialistic. Maybe this could be too where um, this is like unexpected trouble. What's this? What's this nine of wands reverse? The ten of wands reverse. Somebody here cannot feel well. This could be chronic fatigue, or I don't know something going on with somebody's body. They don't feel well. But something is just like beating a dead horse here with somebody because they're really rigid. They're stubborn. They want things to go in their way. Yeah, somebody here did something to block a opportunity, but I feel like what they were trying to block, they were somebody here was doing something with. They're trying, somebody's like trying to block something that's already not for you. That's the thing. This <laughs> is like that. That's what I'm saying. Like, what's the nine of wands in reverse with the ten of wands reverse? And that's why this tower hitting so hard because their intentions is fucked up. They don't know your life. They don't know your journey. But they're intentionally trying to block something that is not for you anyways. You were going to drop it anyways. It seems like it's just inevitable. The tower is coming in at the right time. Four of Cups. 
Yeah, somebody's getting rejected or something here has been at a stalemate. Something has been at a stalemate and it's been like beating a dead horse with this person. And so I feel like you're kind of like letting it go. Something is just is not protected either. Like somebody's not protected. They they wilding. They doing something that they they in the wrong situation. And I feel like maybe you could have been in the wrong situation with this person. Ten of Cups, Three of Wands, and the, and the King of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like this is what's coming in. A real connection with somebody here that's loyal, stable, and solid. What's this Knight of Pentacles reverse? So somebody here missed an opportunity. Now, for some of you... Yeah, child, look at this fucking loser. <laughs> the Emperor in the reverse with the Hangman reverse. Yeah, so some sort of negative patterns here have been on repeat. Somebody's like really stuck. They're really stagnant with this imprint reverse. This could have something to do with somebody's stability, security. No structure, no discipline, no focus, no ambition, no assertiveness. But for some of you, this could also be a, a, a narcissist, Virgo, Aries, Energy, Pisces. Yeah, this person is a. Uh, somebody here is trying to abuse their power and position of authority. And that's not, Spirit is not having it. They're not. Somebody got a chip on their shoulder with you. They really do. And I feel like they're frustrated that things are delayed or set back or whatever this is. Hmm. I feel like they need to get the fuck. This <laughs> is like, seriously, what's the Emperor Reverse? Yeah, three of cups in the damn reverse. Gossiping. A lot of gossiping or somebody here excessively doing something or overindulging in something. This could be somebody too losing people around them, like they're losing friends or people don't want to fuck with them no more. What's the Emperor reverse here, Cup reverse? Uh, okay, yeah, the King of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the King of Pentacles talks about status. Somebody here doing something for status or money recognition like they doing something what's who the king of pentacles so this person somebody here could be married but they're what's king of pentacles <laughs> yeah the moon yeah how somebody accumulated something or how somebody got something is not what it is this person abuses their power and position of authority and this king of pentacles is shape-shifting or this could be something that shifted in your energy. You've gotten something. But I feel like somebody did something for status. Because the King of Pentacles is wealthy. People fuck with them because they got money and all kind of shit. But I feel like this is a facade. This person is gossiping or pillow talking. Or they're doing something to have some sort of... um To make them feel like they're in a position of power. They abuse their power to feel like this. This is, you know, what I'm saying. So... <clears throat> Maybe somebody, too, is hiding the fact that they're married. They have another relationship somewhere, but they out here doing this shit to you. Like, this shit getting ready to blow up in somebody's face. This getting ready to blow up in their face. What? What? Huh? Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, it's in the... Let me see. Hold on.
Anyways, yeah. Uh, let me see. Give me more on this King of Pentacles with the moon. Somebody here hiding the fact that they married. And whoever they're married to, for some of you, is gossiping. So if this was like an emperor in the reverse, I mean, an emperor at some point, they lost their way. This person here, that could be why there's a change of plans here. Because somebody didn't fucking um, do their work. They didn't do their internal work here. Just period. What's the King of Pentacles with the moon? But... I feel like this is a damn narcissist in your energy. Like they, yeah, look, Six of Pentacles in reverse. This could be extortion. It's literally extortion, bribing other people here to gossip about you or whatever to gain control and power. Literally, it could be a Virgo. Cancer Pisces, Aries. They got that shit in their raggedy ass fucking chart. I feel like some sort of sacrifice that didn't fucking go through. Something didn't work here. I feel like this person, too, they have addictions or they have sex a lot. Like, somebody is... <clears throat> somebody's a loser. <laughs> let's, put it, let's put it like that. This person is hiding the fact... They're hiding how the fuck they made money. They're hiding how the fuck they made money here. Mm. they're hiding that they're a damn scammer or loser <laughs> fucking this is like gifts with strings attached to i feel like they do this to a lot of people too they hurt a lot of people in the process this person is a fucking clown so whatever they ask you to go through they deserve it what's this unsent messages two of wands what's unsent messages two of wands the eight of cups So I feel like, yeah, you've made this, the decision to walk away from something. You made a decision to walk away from something here. Because it wasn't emotionally fulfilling on top of the fact that you just see the bigger picture in the situation. This is Two of Wands. Yeah, the Nine of Swords. What's Two of Wands, Nine of Swords? This could be... um. Yeah, seven of wands in reverse. Yeah, I feel like you surrender something. You surrender something. But I feel like somebody here, somebody feels defeated. Whoever this is that's stubborn or whatever, somebody's not standing up for something that they believe in. They fall for every fucking thing here. <laughs> they fall for any damn thing. Somebody's a loser. The fool and the magician reverse. The ace of pentacles. Somebody took a dumbass leap of faith too. For some of you, I'm getting, whoever this emperor is in the reverse, this person... Somebody has hid the fact that they're committed, they're married. And I feel like they tried to, something was unequal. You're trying to figure out why you're not receiving the love and the care that you deserve from somebody, like why they're undervaluing you. I feel like it's because there's a third party. So you're leaving that situation behind. And whoever this emperor is in reverse, I feel like that's somebody closer to you, like your ex or your baby daddy or your baby mama or whatever that's been like benefiting off of you being in such situations like this should have been coming out a lot like they benefit and pull on your energy when you're dealing with this low vibrational shit with these people that's trying to put you in the third parties and make you look like you're a hoe or something like that they don't tell you that they with these lazy i ain't mean to say that but they don't tell you that they're with these lazy ass hoes and i guess <laughs> these hoes is lazy they, they don't tell you that they they stuck with them hoes they just pop up in your life like yeah i'm single there's nothing going on but they don't tell you to have queen of cups and reverse ass hoes that they with. <laughs> I'm trying to make it seem like they're single just to keep you like I feel like that's unfair. There could be two masculines here. They can ready to get that ass whooped, period. But for some of you, this could be just one person. This person has done a lot of playing around in your energy. So yeah, I, you know, somebody's nervous, what, about the fact that you lost respect for their ass? You did. And I feel like two of wands is you moving forward. You you don't have no respect for this person, yeah. They, you don't have no respect for whoever these people are. You don't fuck with none of their asses. Because I feel like somebody don't stand up for what they believe in or they just weak as fuck. What's seven of wands reverse? <laughs> like, literally, yeah, the fool. I feel like you're. this could be you, like, admitting defeat in a situation because it's just too much for you to keep fighting over. 
or dealing with it's just not fair for you to keep dealing with it for what you're not getting anything out of it no investment something is not growing something is not changing like what the fuck and then I feel like somebody got you in competition with a bitch here that they ain't even talking about. Like, fuck them. <laughs> and it's keeping you stuck in a low vibrational energy where somebody else is doing magic and all this dumb shit. I feel like, yeah, that's that's over with. What's the Nine of Swords? And yeah, the Seven of Swords here. Somebody here continuously lying about something. Could be another Aquarius. Somebody could have Aquarius Moon, Gemini Mars, Leo Mars. So somebody's nervous because they know what they snuck around and did. What's this damn nine of swords, seven of swords? They know that they were sneaking around and doing some shit behind your back. Yeah, the ten of swords in reverse, Gemini, sun. Yeah, I feel like you, this could be you keeping your moves and shit silent to yourself. This is you overcoming some sort of obstacles and challenges here. I feel like somebody too is lying. They're sneaking around. And they're lying about them hitting rock bottom. Like they're going through it. And they're lying about it. They're keeping it quiet because they don't they don't want to be embarrassed. But I feel like, bitch, you already embarrassed. <laughs> it's already done. It's already a said and done deal, honey. You're embarrassed. You're embarrassing. <laughs> like, we see you. It is what it is. So now somebody what? They're wanderless, they're lost. They don't know what the fuck to do, possibly, with that two of wands. Or they're anticipating you to come back or something like that. I feel like you're not. So they can be scribbling without sending. I feel like they need to fucking don't even scribble. Don't even even think about trying to send some shit because it's a no. Now they're sitting up here nervous. Please. What's the what's the eight of cups? I feel like you had to overcome some sort of slander or gossip or this person participated in it and they're hiding the fact that they did that or they listened to somebody that gossiped about you or whatever this is. For some of you, this person could be lying about the fact that they hexed you and cursed you and your ass overcame it. Now they're sitting up here nervous. They went behind your back and did some nasty shit to you. And you overcame it. Who's the head of cups? Yeah, the ten of pentacles in reverse. What's the head of cups, ten of pentacles in reverse? The five of pentacles. So yeah, somebody's going broke. Five of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. There's like fights and shit about money. Somebody here definitely tried to steal your inheritance, whether it be spiritually, probably so, with that magic or whatever the fuck this shit is. I feel like somebody here chose wealth and money over like a real connection too. And they asses, they look dumb. <laughs> Ten of Pentacles in reverse is a whole empire crashing down. There's fights and shit about money and... This could also be, too, where you have broken a generational curse by leaving somebody ass out in the cold because they needed to be left out in the damn cold. What's what's this um, Five of Pentacles? Yeah, definitely 10. You guys would be saying 10-10. Yeah, what's the fuck? You made it through something. Somebody is so shocked. That you got through something here. What's Ten of Pentacles reverse? I got that for Sagittarius. Yeah, Page of Cups in reverse. Yeah, somebody in someone's family or somebody in your damn family is jealous. They don't want to be seen a certain way. They don't want to look a certain way. What's Ten of Pentacles reverse? Page of Cups reverse. There could be some sort of bad news about somebody family member being sick too. For some of you, somebody's child is fucking sick. Motherfuckers don't give a fuck about their kids or their family when they start doing shit like this. Somebody is hiding the fact, too, that they're very promiscuous, they're jealous, very hateful energy. What's Ten of Pentacles reverse, Page of Cups reverse? I feel like you're walking away from somebody, too, where they're struggling with their vulnerability. They're struggling with, like, really healing. <clears throat> somebody could have some sort of child abuse issues here trigger warning that they haven't healed from page of swords in the reverse yeah a lot of gossip just a lot of gossip and friends somebody has gossiped about you lied to you about you to to their family maybe to get them to attack you or just to get different people to do things to you like somebody did a fucking lie a lot of a lot of malicious gossip here and slander 
somebody here could have done something too to cause you to feel scatterbrained and to really block your intuition in some way shape form or fashion to really trigger your inner child to the point where you wouldn't want to heal you know it would be too hard for you to do so but you're a warrior i feel like somebody here don't know who the fuck you are <laughs> like that that's 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 what i'm saying like they, they really don't but what's the five of pentacles yeah the hermit could be a virgo what's five of pentacles here with the hermit there's a lot of bad news here too yeah yeah six of wands in reverse a whole damn smear campaign clout chasing being around people that have ill intentions here for ill purposes Somebody here could be hiding because they could be in conflict with other people too. Because they made you look bad for no reason when they're the one with the problem. They're the one that's got left out on the cold. They're the one that's feeling abandoned. They're the ones with the problems that they refuse to heal. Everybody got problems, but bitch, you need to do something to heal that shit. And they're not. This person would rather have flying monkeys, a smear campaign to do shit to you and then hide it. It's like they threw the rock and hid their hand. All because they felt rejected by you or whatever. Like, somebody's a loser. Yeah, the magician reverse and the world reverse. Somebody here had high hopes for this magic working and they're disappointed. They're mad. They're upset that something didn't work. <sighs> oh, boy. What a shame. What is this provocateur? Not afraid to challenge the status quo. Ruffles a few feathers. Challenger. Tampering. Sabotaging. Bully. Deceitful persuading others negatively yeah wild things shortly what's that shit <laughs> the two of cups in the reverse what else the sun yeah whatever this shit is is just being exposed for some of you somebody's in a fake ass karmic connection here that's being exposed to that somebody got into a connection just to what bully you or make you mad or make you upset somebody here tried to get other people to bully you because they set up here and lie to all these damn people. For some of you, somebody's in a relationship that's where there's two people that don't even get along. They're incompatible. They probably got together here to try to bully you. <laughs> the shit is being exposed. The sun, Leo energy. So yeah, this is like freedom. This could be you breaking free of some sort of soul tie with whoever the fuck this is that you was with that did this shit behind your back. Like, there's a soul tie that's being um, severed. What's to a custom reverse? Or this could be like a breakup. What's to a custom reverse? I feel like now everybody's scattering. They look dumb. The Knight of Cups. What's to a custom reverse? Knight of Cups. The High Priestess reverse and the Temperance in the reverse. Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Pisces. Yeah, if you're wondering why you can't date or why you can't, why it's so hard for you to date and do certain things, there's like a lot of unwanted attention coming your way from this high priestess reverse, temperance reverse. <clears throat> And this is all about somebody you're not even with anymore. Two of cups in the reverse. Like, I feel like you've been broke up with them. And they're the ones that probably abused you and did nasty shit to you. But they're being seen as somebody with status. Or they want to be seen like that with they fucking raggedy ass. <laughs> Somebody's a loser. The high priestess in reverse is doubting your intuition or whatever. That's because there's chaos and drama going on in your energy. This could be somebody here doing something in excess too. Somebody also is very sexual. Like, somebody has a problem. What's the high priestess in reverse? This could be a dark witch here. Confirmation. Yeah, the devil in the reverse. What's the high priestess reverse? Devil reverse. Yeah, this is like the judgment in the reverse. Mm. Yeah, you're detaching from an energy here. You detach and there's still gossip and slander or false accusations here. It's just dumb shit going on. A lot of chaos and disharmony with the temperance reverse drama somebody being really self-indulgent what's the damn temperance reverse yeah the knight of wands somebody just all over the place with their energy <laughs> uh, 
Queen of Pentacles reverse, the damn King of Cups, and the Three of Wands. Some of y'all could be moving on with the King of Cups, or you're moving away from somebody that has feelings for you, but they put you in this mess. Or now somebody is like wants to be nice or whatever the fuck this is, man. Queen of Pentacles in reverse could be somebody here doing black magic too. But this could also be you where you've pulled back your energy. Yeah, you pulled back your energy from someone and just started focusing on you. <sighs> and now I feel like maybe you could have a King of Cups coming in to your life that actually matches your energy. Like they care about you just like you care about them. Some of you guys wasn't able, you were so closed off, you wasn't welcoming anything in because of this connection. Whatever this is. I feel like your guys too are protecting you from somebody trying to spy into your love life or spy into your life in general. It's a lot going on. Somebody here has really been running around. They're, they've been the Knight of Wands. They've been unfaithful all over the place. What's the Knight of Cups? Yeah, the Ace of Cups in reverse. A missed opportunity. Unrequited love here. A lot of repressed trauma and pain. What's Knight of Cups with the Ace of Cups reverse? Yeah, Eight of Pentacles in reverse or the Queen of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, somebody tried to ruin your reputation. Whoever this is, man, and they did this with the King of Pentacles in the moon. This person tried to ruin it. I feel like that's you, but it's inverted. It's in the reverse because that's what somebody said that you did to them. They said that you, you were nasty or you could have been a dark witch here and you're not. That's not the case. And this could, for some of you guys, if you dealt with somebody here... It's just a lot going on. <laughs> I'm getting like two or three situations here. Or they all just mirror the same. Like they mirror each other. It's been going on for a while with all your relationship shit. But I feel like somebody said that, oh, you, they broke up with you. You still want them. They're doing, you're doing dark magic to get them back or whatever. And that's not the case. Somebody had really tried to ruin your reputation in that sense. Because they're the ones that's upset or mad that you really pulled your energy back from them. So they've gotten, what, dark witches to try to, like, um, cause chaos and conflict in your love life and shit like that, too, with their raggedy fucking ass. What's this damn? What's the sun? The Ten of Cups. What's the sun with the Ten of Cups? Damn, some of y'all could be pregnant. There's fertility here. Some of y'all getting ready to... Um, build a family. This could be a divine connection here. Yeah, maybe with the King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Yeah, some of you guys are with another air sign or something. But there's a divine connection coming in here with the sun. Yeah, and this is a, a very strong masculine. I feel like uh, they're not in distorted energy. So somebody here still running around fucking with hoes, pillow talking and lying about what the fuck really going on. To gain some sort of status or to seek or make people see them a certain way with they fucking ass. But I feel like you see them just like how they are, raggedy and pathetic. And just like how they've been. You just didn't see it at first. Now you see it. <laughs> so, okay. It could be a Leo. Doesn't have to be. Apron, nurturing, crafting, hospitality, protection, clean image, exactly. Traditional readiness, stay focused, protecting yourself while being flexible, instincts. For some of you, this this King of Pentacles here loud about being with a dark witch here. Maybe they didn't know, but now they fucking know. And I feel like, you know, this person tried to ruin your reputation. Yeah, this is the person that's been saying that you was doing shit to them and it's not true. That's not true. This person knew that this person, this King of Pentacles wanted to date you. Or they were trying to get out of this fucked up marriage or whatever this shit is. And they did something to ruin the connection. But I feel like this is somebody too that's been 
like they're not even together or they could be married but they're separated but you know that's technically still legally married and i feel like somebody's been trying to get out of a connection and it's just been hard they haven't been they haven't been able to so that's just drama and i feel like you removed yourself from it now you have somebody else or somebody something is coming in for you that just makes sense that's who the fuck you supposed to be with you're not supposed to be in no third party shit with no damn body this is like what the fuck so it's a reliable partnership in business dependable profits from business flexible and multi-talented successful plans unity strength and creative ideas somebody here knew that you was going to be protection for whoever like for this person and they try to stop it somebody's a just a loser Struggling to solve problems, stuck, lack of knowledge and clarity, confusion, mistakes, disconnections, and frustrations. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What else? Incense. Trying to get rid of guilt, unsure of oneself, greed, illusions, unaware, fake spirituality. Exactly. And strenuous efforts towards goals and stress life then we have right here doing something you're not proud of envious being taken advantage of sad sneaky thief inner fear of being stabbed in back guilty and snitch <laughs> i feel like somebody's mad at you because you didn't say something too they wanted this shit to stay hidden and bitch it's not so we have snow globe looking down on someone doing all the work undesirable throwing weight and power around consumed by anger isolated calm before storm then we have ruler achievable dreams through careful planning sound judgments logical over emotional attention to detail good judge of character yeah this is you where i feel like you you seen something you seen something here about somebody and somebody didn't listen to your ass they really didn't listen at all you seen that somebody with that gemini energy you seen that somebody was two-faced and if you're a Gemini watching me cross walking for an Aquarius, if you're not a two-faced Gemini, then don't take that. But I'm getting low vibrational Geminis are very fucking two-faced. So I don't know. <laughs> yeah, somebody feel feel a kind of way now because I feel like now you're not speaking to them. They refuse to open up to you or whatever because of some dumb shit that somebody here lied about. Instead of them coming to the source and trying to figure out what the fuck really going on, they decided to what, listen? to a losing asshole now they ask now that situation is done i feel like it was meant to happen like that anyway because they ain't for you to, to regardless somebody is too stuck in a damn marriage or in a relationship that's not even for them so oh well so we have hammock here sloth like uncomfortable situations disruptive procrastination taking things for granted lazy going through motions without direction and feeling yeah kitchen sink removing difficulties starting fresh take a break being in control, finding solutions, healthy habits, eliminating what no longer serves you, a new path. Exactly. Teeth, worried about how others perceive you, superficial, embarrassed, blocked communication, illness, lack of balance, powerlessness, and low self-esteem. And we got phone. Reconnection with old friends or past love, changes, positive news, feeling connected, new love, fun, being understood, trustworthy, and connected to guys. Yeah, so that's you letting the situation just be what it's going to be. That's what it is. Like somebody let a hoe sit there and ruin your reputation, say nasty things about you, and they sat up there and believed it. Or they just didn't know, and it is what it is. But I don't know. Something, this situation cannot come back to how it was, though. It's something that this person did like that they, they can't come back from I, I feel like they listened to somebody that really made them you you lost respect for them just period you're done and, and i feel like this person here automatically it's a dub because they lied they lied about being married they lied about being with somebody in the first damn place anybody that wants to be with you or loves you or cares about you will not put you in that kind of predicament this person wanted to cheat somebody's a cheater this queen of pentacles is definitely one but i feel like yeah this bitch here had some sort of motives here to use this king of pentacles this person is cheating and running around too for some of you somebody's cheating 
and there's a somebody's not the father of a child or whatever the motive was to get this person to like to use them for their money and so they needed to keep you away from this person but i feel like that shit happened the way it's supposed to you're supposed to not be with their ass anyway for whatever reason only spirit and you know i guess yeah big yikes major embarrassment feeling shameful yeah because they there's an antagonist here doing shit to you and they ain't believe it or they didn't want to see it or whatever this is oh well so this is your reading aquarius i hope this reading gave you clarity like comment subscribe turn your notification bell on press the all button so you won't miss my reads and i'll talk to y'all later bye